Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Smoking Jazz Barbecue. <laughs> so question for you guys. Have you ever had some smoked turkey legs? Have you ever had smoked turkey legs from Universal Studios, Disneyland, or Disney World? Man, they are so delicious. They are packed with flavor, but sometimes they can be a little bit tad dry. But guess what, guys? We're gonna make our version today. Smoking Jazz Barbecue version today. And this video that you're seeing right now is gonna be dedicated to my boy. One of my viewers is a constant subscriber of mine and he always comes on my videos and makes a great comment, man. Salute to my guy, Tavis the man. This video is for you, my dude. Thank you so much for supporting my channel. Thank you so much for spreading my channel to all your family and friends. And I appreciate you. So guys, we're gonna get started right now. Start our pit balls real quick. Turn the power on and we're gonna take it to the smoke setting and open our lid. And as always, open that smoke stack if you have one. All right, folks, as you can see, we got smoke rolling right now from the chamber, and so it's time to close our lid. And we're gonna crank this temperatures up to 300 degrees, guys. 300. All right, folks, so we're at 425 degrees. It's been about 10 to 15 minutes. And as you can see, we're at 335 and a little above that 300 mark. So this grill is cleaning itself out. It's gonna get off all that dirt, all that extra debris that we didn't get off from our last cook. So let's take a look inside. Oh yeah, that's hot. Take a look at these turkey legs, guys. Wow. These bad boys are looking phenomenal, and as I always state, these are looking good right now, and we haven't done nothing to them. Oh, man. All right, guys, I'm going to take these to the grill, and we're going to flavor them up with some good old smoky flavor. You see that smoke, guys? You see that smoke? <laughs> Smell that aroma. Oh, man, it's so good. <laughs> this bad boy is bad. Oh, man, it smells so good right now, guys. Anyway, let's talk about the step process of what we're doing today. So, we basically, we took our turkey legs and we just did a simple brine solution them and we let it brine for overnight. And what's well, in that brine, it's very simple. Some brown sugar, some water, have a cup of my all-purpose barbecue rub, but you can add your all-purpose barbecue rub or whatever rub you want to add. You can just use some kosher salt. It's going to do its job. And all I did was add about half a teaspoon of thyme. A little bit go along the way, guys. So with that brown solution, oh, it made those turkey legs nice, juicy, and it's going to be so moist. And this bad boy right here, oh, man. It's gonna add some great favor, guys. So we basically season up with some McCormick's uh, roasted garlic chicken and that McCormick's barbecue rub. Oh man, that color, that flavor, it's gonna impact these turkey legs with some good old, old fashioned flavor seasoning and it's gonna make your mouth water and dance like it's a party. <laughs> So we're gonna cook these bad boys at 300 degrees and that's gonna be very high guys. So we're gonna check them about 45 minutes to see where we at as far as temperature goes. Then we're gonna spin them around and flip them. The reason why we're gonna do that guys is because we wanna ensure an even cook throughout this entire cook. So we're shooting for a target temperature of 175 on these turkey legs. I know 165 is the safe temperature to eat, but I wanna crisp up that skin. So I might shoot for 175, 180, 185, and we wanna make sure these gonna brown up and get that mahogany brown color, guys, and crisp up that skin. And this is gonna be my take on smoked turkey legs. Disney World, Universal Studios, my version. Smoking jazz barbecue version. Yes, sir. Cruz, you want some turkey legs? <laughs> you want some turkey legs, buddy? 
<laughs> oh yeah, you see that smile, guys? <laughs> Good boy. Good boy, boo boo. Good boy. All right, guys, it's been about 45 minutes. And as you can see, oh yeah. So what we're gonna do, guys, I'm gonna flip these bad boys around just to ensure I even cook on both sides. And then we're gonna cook it for another half an hour. Oh, before I do that, I'm gonna temp these guys to see where our temperature is at. So let's probe and see where we at. We should stick it right here on the side. 145, 142. Okay, let's check the one in the middle. Take a look at where we at with these guys. One sixty-seven. Okay. Take the one from here. One sixty-five. Okay. So I'm gonna let these go for another 10 to 15 minutes, guys, and we should be at 175 and at 181. So guys, let's talk about what's going on right now. So we're currently at 165, 167 on these bad boys right there. So, you know, at this point, what you can do is take the legs off and hit them with some barbecue sauce and glaze them up and let them caramelize for the last 15 minutes or so. Um, I'm just choosing not to caramelize them with any barbecue sauce because I want to have that authentic, you know, Disneyland, Disney World, or Universal Studios turkey leg, that smoked turkey leg. So the purpose of me doing this version is because it's gonna be the smoked version without any barbecue sauce. So guys, we're almost there at the last mark and we're about to come upon the best part of the entire video. The taste test. Oh man, can't wait to taste these bad boys. That's what I'm talking about right there, guys. Take a look at these bad boys. They are done. All right, guys, so I'm gonna pull these off the grill and we're gonna let them rest for about 10 to 15 minutes and we're gonna do the best part of the entire video, the taste test. All right, guys, so it's been about 10 to 15 minutes. I've been desperately waiting patiently for these bad boys right here. So this is the best part of the entire video. Oh, man. So, loosely covered. In fact, we don't need this. Take a look at these guys. Oh, yeah. <laughs> man. This one got my name on it. Oh man, you see that guys? Woo. Take a look at that. It's so juicy. Look at that. Look at that guys. It's so juicy and moist. You see the glistening? Wow. <laughs> guys, let's take a bite. I've been waiting for this all day. Mm. <laughs> this is good. Packed with flavor, is moist, is juicy. Mmm. Sorry, but this is pre pit master's privilege, <laughs> guys. Oh man, this was phenomenal. Let's do a quick recap, guys. So we basically what we did was brine these turkey legs with some simple brown solution. Um, you know, a little bit of uh, water, a little bit of brown sugar, a little bit of all-purpose barbecue rub, and then we season with some McCormick's roasted garlic chicken and McCormick's barbecue rub. Oh man, that's how we got that color. That's how we got those impact flavor. And we hit them with some smoke. The smoke flavor we used today was a little bit of apple, cherry, and maple. To me, for poultry, that's the perfect combination because it goes really, really well with that. And guys, we cooked it at 300 degrees for about hour, hour and a half. Man, phenomenal. That's how we got that juiciness going on right there, guys. Tender, moist, 
and it's packed with flavor smoked turkey legs. Smoking Jazz barbecue version of smoked turkey legs. Guys, if you like barbecuing and grilling, this is your channel right here. So make sure you share this with all your family and friends and tell everybody about Smoking Jazz barbecue. And until next time, guys, peace.